what you are about to witness are two young dudes using the lower level kitchen as an area to not only do a little bit of work at a time but also to sort of hang out play around goof off they're using this area as that almost like a sort of a hangout spot where I'm going to do a little cleaning here and there but I'm also going to use it as a little hangout spot to sort of get away from upstairs and they're down there for hours all right they're down there for hours leading into or leading close enough to the time of Kanika going in the lower level area and also going into the upper stairs kitchen around this time they are both seen in this area at least an hour away from the time she walks in but this is the thing from the time they're in there and they disappear you don't see them come out only thing you see is that they're not on the cameras anymore but you never see them exit the lower level area after two roughly 224 maybe somewhere up in that you don't see them come out now there are many ways out of those areas but all of those ways out of those areas always lead into the camera unless you go into the docking area if you go into the docking area of course they say the cameras don't work other than the docking area you can take whatever route you want out of those areas and you still will lead yourself into one of the following areas the southwest entry area the east bar entrance area and I'm talking about the cameras the name of the cameras alright the full court hall area the full court hall west the meeting halls and the meeting hall west and the elevators also the lobby those areas you must enter once you exit out of the kitchen area the only way to go around that is the docking area outside of the docking area the only way to go around that is if you live in the lower level section if you don't live in the lower level section in the lower level kitchen then you must come out they were not spotted on either of these cameras leading into Kanika going into the lower level kitchen area and going into the upper stairs kitchen area these guys are never seen again they don't come out of those areas and the only area that they could could have went out of without being spotted is the docking area which leads to wondering when did they clock out they have to clock out meaning they have to come out of those areas and go into those previously mentioned cameras 
in order to clock out. They have to clock out. They never reappear into these cameras after 224. Once they are into the lower level areas, they just disappear out of the cameras. But they never reappear in any of the other cameras upstairs. Meaning they never exit those areas from the lower level or the upper kitchen area. They never exit those areas. Unless they went out into the docking area, and again, that means they never clocked out. And if they never clocked out, then that means they ran for a reason. So here, I'm going to give you not only them in the footage, but I'm going to also give you their characteristics while they're down there. In the things that they are doing while they're down there. We've all been young before. We've all had those jobs where we are sort of left alone to do what we want to do or do what we have to do. And we sort of find a spot where we can chill and still kind of do our job but still sort of bullshit around because we know no one's there but us. So this is that environment. 